Hi, what's up guys? We're introducing a new product today. It is our nootropic. It's called methylene blue. So what's a nootropic? Guys, it's basically any substance that increases our mental skills, like learning, memory, cognition, anti-aging benefits. And guys, look, if you're, whether you're a student trying to do better in school and get better grades, or you're a working mom, or you're a networker with multiple side hustles, or a, a business professional, someone learning a new language, someone learning to play an instrument. Look, the point is, it doesn't matter. We all need to improve our cognition and our mental skills. So what is methylene blue? Well, methylene blue, it's been around and used for over 100 years, multiple different purposes. It's actually used to treat malaria for many years. So now what is it being used for? It's considered a nootropic because it helps to increase focus, cognition, and memory and learning. And so it does this because it helps deliver oxygen to the brain cells. It increases oxygen delivery and it increases ATP production in the mitochondria within the cell. Mitochondria are your powerhouses, your energy factories of the cell. And so by doing so, again, it can really help with mood disorders. It can help with cell, with aging and uh, autophagy and getting rid of some of the older cells. And, and so there's a lot of promise in this category. They're, sh they're showing benefits for mood depressive disorders for neurodegenerative diseases like Alzheimer's and Parkinson's and just basic things like cognition and functioning memory and all that. So I'm going to demonstrate, I'm going to show you how to use methylene blue. These are a plant-based uh, oral, these are films, these are dissolving films. So it'll actually sit on your tongue. It is a blue salt. It's, it's so it's a vibrant blue salt. So when you put it on, it's going to stain the tongue. And by the way, it's going to stain your urine. That is normal and to be expected. Um, so when I do put this on, one of the things I recommend is that you seek natural light. If you can go out in the light within the first 30 minutes of taking methylene blue and get five to 15 minutes of natural light, guys, it acts synergistically. It's actually called photobiomodulation. It can improve the production of ATP in the mitochondria. So that's why we suggest doing that. The dosing is uh, one film every other day. So 15 films is a 30 day supply. And just real quick, who should not take it? Pregnancy and breastfeeding, do not take methylene blue. If you're currently on an antidepressant or something for mood disorder, you consult with your physician first. And if you have G6PD, which is a genetic mutation, you should not take methylene blue. But besides that, definitely try it out, check it out. So I'm gonna put this on my tongue and then I'm gonna go get some sun, but I wanna demonstrate this to you. And if, guys, if you wanna try to minimize the blue on the tongue, you can put it on the back, back of your tongue and try to swallow it quickly. But if you can see, all right, here we go. Here's the film. We're gonna just drop this on the tongue and then I'm off.